they have now uh, used the words foul play. They are convinced now that there is foul play involved. Two months after Fort Hood soldier Vanessa Guillen's disappearance, the Houston native's family is seeing some progress in her case. Guillen's mother refused to meet with Fort Hood leaders Tuesday. ¿Por qué hasta ahora andan haciendo ese show de buscar a mi hija? ¿Por qué hasta ahora? Yo sigo justicia y sigo que se me respete y se me respete a mi hija. She says, why are they doing this show for my daughter? Why now? I want justice and respect for me and my daughter. Gloria Guillen watched as authorities searched near Leon River Monday, looking for her daughter, and believes investigators instead should search every inch of the base. The private first class was last seen on April 22nd. After speaking with CID, Guillen's attorney now has a timeline she says is riddled with discrepancies. There are so many gaps and holes in what we learned today that I am going to demand a congressional investigation for this family. We want to know what happened and who is cover up for who and why are they covering up. Guillen was last seen in the parking lot of her regimental engineer squadron headquarters. Her car keys, barracks room key, identification card and wallet were found in the armory room where she was said to be working earlier that day. Her cell phone is still missing. I have spoken with the secretary of the army. I have spoken to uh, White House Chief of Staff Mark Meadows. I've talked to Senator Cruz. Everyone is in agreement. We will give this base the assets and some resources that they need to make sure that we find Vanessa. Before her disappearance, Guillen told her family she was being sexually assaulted by a sergeant at the base, but did not report it for fear of retaliation. Those allegations are being investigated. Guillen's story has caught national attention, resonating with women who say they have also been sexually harassed in the military. And the I am Vanessa Guillen is encouraged the women to have and still are passing through the sexual harassment because they're the ones risking their life for us and come and come back. They're the ones protecting us and serving the nation. No woman should be seen as a sexual object because they're the ones they're, they're just like my sister. Pushing through the pain and anger, Guillen's mother held on to a red rosary, praying for help, praying her daughter will be found. Because my daughter is my life, she says, I want justice, justice for my little one.